So guys, and I'm going to be showing you three Android hacks you can do without rooting your phone. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first application on this list is called Debian. So this is a full desktop operating system Linux on your Android device. So it's pretty cool. Uh, do know that you have to have about 900 megabytes free if you're thinking about installing this, but it works pretty decently. Uh, it doesn't do it on 4.4 or uh, any older software than that. So take note of that also but it's pretty cool as you can see it's very smooth it works uh, the controls took a little bit to get used to but it's really cool and I really enjoyed it uh, messing around with Linux on your phone it's pretty cool what these phones can do nowadays you can even download and install games over here and you can even use the web browser on here too which is pretty cool Next up is an application called Heart Rate. So pretty much what this application does is uses the LED flash as a heart rate monitor. So from what I've been told, the technology behind heart rate monitors on Android devices is pretty much just a light that tracks color changes under your skin to monitor the amount of blood passing through. With the right software, an LED can do that too. So as you can see, uh, you can go ahead and try it out for yourself. It, seem pretty decent to me but you know you can never know but it seems like a pretty cool little hack anyway so coming up next is auto start so auto start is a pretty cool application so what this does is it'll allow certain applications to boot up uh, when you start your android device up so you can go ahead and pick an application you can go ahead and set it you can even set the start delays and the next app delays and stuff like that so it's pretty cool i found that it worked pretty decently um, so as you can see, when I booted up my phone, the weather pops up and when you scroll down, it'll have a notification up there letting you know and stuff like that. So a pretty cool application that I found, Button Saver. So pretty much what this is, is on screen shortcuts that you can do. So you can see I can put my device to sleep. If I want to straight from the screen, I can go home. I can put a, bring up the multitasker, go back. I can even go to do the volume up, volume down. You can even come in here and assign your own actions. So whatever you want to put in here in the settings, you can go ahead and customize it the way you want it to. So I think it's a really cool application. Do remember that all these applications are free. So thanks for watching this video, guys, and I'll see you all in the next one.